What are you doing, Juliana? I'm correcting math. That's nice. I, I <laughs> want to tell you about something that you didn't know about <laughs> and that you all didn't know about. That today, we've waited and waited for this day, but now, we're going to become famous. We are? Yes. I, we're going to be very, very famous, straight up famous. And you're going to have to see why <laughs> as our vlog unfolds. <laughs> hey, what are you doing here? Checking math. Oh, but you want to film a vlog instead, right? I want to check sixth grade math right now. Hey, Georgia. What you say, Georgia? Good girl. I'm teaching you history. Put it down. Down. No. Good. Sit. Good girl. There you go. Good girl. Good girl. Good girl. Good girl. Good girl. What have you taught her so far? Um. Sit. Stay. Down. Come. And I'm trying to teach her shake. And not to bite. <laughs> well, we still have some odds and ends that need to get done on the house in there. And I was thinking I would get the chainsaw and just get the energy out as we anticipate the moment that we become famous. But anyway, um, just kind of take down these trees and see what I could do with that. You know, my paint work has been slow this month though. And, it's, and I've got all these kind of things I could be doing around the house. But being kind of ADD, it's very easy for me to get distracted. <laughs> Trampoline! <laughs> oh, this is so fun! I can't even believe we have one of these! Like I said, it's easy to get distracted from the things I'm doing, so I have to kind of pick something and stick with it and try and do the best I can to just get it done. I always thought maybe someday I would be famous. That's just, I guess I just thought maybe. And, uh, you know, we all hope for our 15 minutes of fame, but this is really going to be more than that. If I was going to be famous, I thought I'd be like a rock singer. I guess this is kind of it, but it's, you, just, you just never know. Alright, time to take the trees down. Like I've said in previous vlogs, is that uh, we want to make this kind of a place of fellowship, a place of community. What I'm doing here is trying to get rid of this section right here. We have an island here of trees, and then another island of trees back here, and another island of trees back here. And what I want to do is try and get rid of this stuff while it's still winter, and uh, I don't have to be dealing with snakes and whatever else, so that uh, we can clear this area out and go over here and get a uh, get a backhoe as well and uh, clear that area out. We want to start putting a garden back in there. What do you think of Georgia so far, Olivia? She's nice. What were you talking about doing on this land yourself just now? I'd like to start a rabbit tree. A rabbit tree. No. Yeah. A rabbit I think tree. we can do that with the oh a rabbit tree. You want to break that down for our audience? Some people might not know what that is. <laughs> It's, uh, I'd breed bunnies and sell them. What kind of bunnies? I don't know yet. Okay. But. So, yeah, a rabbit tree isn't something that, a tree that grows rabbits. It's just, it's what she said it was. Georgia! Georgia! If we're gonna be feeding you, you need to earn your keep. Here, you take some branches. Go. Go. Bring them to the burn pile. Burn pile! Whew. Okay, so my chainsaw I got from a secondhand store and it's conked out. I gotta give it a few, maybe a few hours to let it rest. Anyway, gives me a chance to come see if we're famous yet. So the video has appeared. We're ready to tell you why we're famous. Tiny Notes from Home and also Sounds Like Rain have put us on one of their silo songs. The silo songs are beautiful, unbelievable, and we've heard some amazing ones, and we're on this next one. Are you excited? Yeah, I'm very excited. Did they put the video out? 
Yes, they did. They put it out this morning. What do you expect? It was really fun filming it, and mm. it was really fun singing it, and really neat to hear the um, echo of the inside of the silo. Yeah, I, w I didn't hear the inside, but yeah. All right, so we're gonna go film it. Okay, Juliana, before we watch this, fame isn't gonna change us at all, is it? No. No, it's not. We're not going to treat our friends any differently from this day. We don't want to even treat our children differently, even though we're really famous parents, <laughs> right? That's right. You got to hear. We're not going to treat anybody different. We'll treat some people a little differently, but mostly. Never mind. Scrap that. Treat everybody the same. That's a beautiful song and just powerful, good lyrics. And you guys did great. I, could you hear me? You weren't in it. I was shouting on the outside of the silo the entire song and they totally took it out. Just left Juliana and Lindsay in there, so. I thought you took the kids somewhere to go. Oh, probably what, I'll just talk to Bracken and he and I'll do a duet in a library. You know, it's really quiet. I guess if I'm not gonna be famous this way, I guess I can just keep trying to get in the background of newscasts. How many times have you tried to do that? A lot. I guess I'm just shy. Okay, I'm not serious. I knew I wasn't in the song and I wasn't even singing out loudly outside the silo. I was in my van. Seriously, the song is really good and you really need to check out the Sounds Like Rain channel and check out Nearer My God to Thee, but don't only check that song out. They've got some really wonderful worship music um, just while you're at your house or whatever you want something to listen to just pull up their stuff and it's really edifying really good stuff awesome worship songs don't you think so yes what's your favorite one Jules? Music. what's your favorite one that i don't know what my favorite one is, is but i really like the they do wonderful merciful savior with some of their sons and that's a really pretty one mm -hmm. that's one of my favorite ones yep you know when we renovated this house as you saw before we still have little things here and there that we need to do. And I need to get on those things right now. Our last electric bill was 350 plus dollars, so I'm trying to find these air pockets in the house and close them off so we stop losing some, so much heat. You know, all kidding aside, I love what our friends Bracken and Lindsay are doing. Producing worship music that helps us all to turn our eyes on Jesus and get closer to Him. In Ephesians 5, 18 through 20 it says, And do not get drunk with wine, for this is dissipation, but be filled with the Spirit, speaking to one another in psalms and hymns and spiritual songs, singing and making melody with your heart to the Lord, always giving thanks for all things in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ to God even the Father. Worship, singing, and thanksgiving to God is one of the ways He empowers us to walk in the Spirit. Do you have a musical gift? A gift for writing songs? Maybe some other gift. Whatever gift He's given to you, use it to the glory of God. Whether seemingly big or seemingly small, I believe God wants to use your gifting to help you and others in some way to get closer to Him. So that's it for this week. I hope you enjoy the Kirkland's video, and I hope that you will join us next week. Hey! No biting. No, no biting. And we'll see you next time on the Jordan Michael Tuesday Show.